Good morning, welcome to Car Rides with Connor. It is February 20th, and despite our best efforts, the time is 6.59. What's our problem? Your guess is as good as mine. I mean, 6.36, I was downstairs making our coffees. That's because... Where did the wheels come off the wagon? Maybe it's because I woke up at 5.40. What time do you usually wake up? Well, I try to get myself. I'll have to wake up at 3, at 5.30. I thought you were going to say 3 a.m. I'm like, okay, we need to re talk about that. Okay. Um, 3 a.m.? That's what I thought you were going to say. <laughs> I appreciate you didn't say that. All right, we've got a situation. Yeah, I mean, who'd want, want to be shopping for groceries at 3 in the morning? Oh, you'd be surprised. Some people like the wacky tobacco and they want a little snacky. <laughs> okay, wait. Um, it's it's Tuesday. It's trash pickup day, and as you can clearly see on the hood of the car and on the windshield, I've got two bags of trash and a box for recycling. Yep. And I can't drive like that. Right. Maybe I could flip the camera to show people. Is there a way to flip the camera? Uh, How do you flip that? Let's. Oh no 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 no. Oh. oh hang no. on. Hang on. No, not no, flip no, that. No no. There, that's not. What's this thing do? Okay, let's leave it because we'll just shut off our video. Okay, well, I, what, I feel what's like, that little uh, what's that little yellow square doing? There? I, don't, I don't know. Well, you, I don't know. What are we doing? Who knows? Is that like on the video? <laughs> oh well, we're we're rolling with a square. Well, we it's can't just, roll. Well, we can't flip the camera with a video. That's Who right. Knew? I don't want to get out and touch that trash. Always has to be me. It's your department. Men, trash, and bugs. Trash and bugs. That's your department. Oh, everything is not your department. He's out there just cussing it up. Everything's not his department. He's, he's so mad. What, he has to put two bags of trash in the trash can? Hold on. Hey, sweetie, that's kind of overflowy. Just be careful. There you go. I have some hand sanitizer for you. That's my department. Hang on, let me get my hand sanitizer. It really frustrates me that I'm the only one who isn't afraid to get my hands dirty. Well, I'm here, right here, a trusty partner with the hand sanitizer. Listen, as far I don't as I'm understand concerned, why bugs, so bugs and trash could be your department or guy's department. And <laughs> what are you and saying? What are you saying? Like, All women are afraid of bugs. I'm not saying that because that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying I'm afraid of bugs, especially <laughs> the size of the roaches around here. Oh, look, we're not the only neighbor with the trash flowing. Okay, so we've got a new. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, right, make sure it's on you. Right. Want to hold these up? We've got a new friend. Yep. Where's our new friend? Our friend, and from Oregon, Buka. Cheers. Thank you very much for these travel mugs. Right. This will make some people very happy. Um, don't get used to this. I love this, but I also love my mug. Yeah, me too. I prefer a good old-fashioned mug. So, we're also trying a new coffee that was sent to Whoa, us. Whoa. What's wrong? That's stuff. Oh, because you know what? You're used to an open mug, and our friend Buka's mug yeah. is keeping it hot, hot stuff, baby, yeah. this evening. Yeah. Okay. This is that new coffee that someone sent us as a package gift. And before we say the name, let's, we don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. Do we like it? Hmm. I need another sip. Hold, please. A couple of sips usually do the trick. How are you feeling about it? I know my opinion. Hmm. What's yours? We got new mugs, new coffee. Like, who are we? Well. Just a couple people from Podunk, Georgia. Well. In the words of Queen Zubeya from the Dragon Prince, in the name of the dragons and the unicorns and the first elves, I declare this coffee delicious. Wow, I was gonna say I like it too, so we can shout out who it is. Um, it was Coochie Coffee. Coochie Coffee, in, yeah, I think, I think so, yeah. In, Los, in California. Yes. Um, so thank you, Coochie Coffee. We like your coffee. We, were, we weren't gonna much. say anything until we knew for a fact that we liked it. Yep. But, um, and this is not a paid advertisement. This is just a thank you because people have been very generous to us. Like, 
And I don't know. I think this could be Buka's business. What does it say on here? Says, I have my contacts um, in. Okay. It says. Ooh, don't tip. It. it says Vellum Design Studio. So if this is Buka's business, which I think it is, because why wouldn't he send that? Yeah. Um, hey, if you're like in Bend, Oregon, or in Oregon area, mm -hmm. well, I think Oregon's big, so maybe not Oregon yeah. area. If you're in the center, he said like the dead center of Oregon. Look this brother up. Yep. He's obviously very talented, and he has quality products because this is a hydro flask, man. Yep. This is legit. Uh -huh. This is not just like your, hey, let me get you some merch cheap knockoff mm -hmm. mug. This is the real dull. I need Coco to find her place in this world because she keeps turning buttons on when she walks across us. Yeah. Like, I don't know what happens. All these little things She just on. keeps pressing buttons. She does. She doesn't <laughs> care. Next thing you know, we're, we're in a ditch. <laughs> Okay, so we like the coffee. We love this. Oh, so Buka is our new friend from Oregon. We actually surprised him with a FaceTime because his gift was so generous. Indeed. And we got to meet his wife, his lovely wife. Oh, sorry. It's a hot coffee. It is hot. We're not, we're not used to this hot of coffee because we always have open mugs. And then, oh, his dog. Oh, yes. His dog, Noli. Like think, he looked like a bear. He looked like a giant bear. It was a, a bear knees mountain dog, and I'm telling you, gorgeous. Like if we could not hurt anyone's feelings, drive to Oregon and kidnap that dog, <laughs> I'd be in. Would you be in? <laughs> uh, maybe. I mean, well, we wouldn't want to hurt their feelings. No, it's like they not. love him, but yeah, love we wish dog. we could have him. Too. Yeah, we do. We do. Yeah. Noli. What does his name rhyme with? Cunoli. But without the cur. What do you say? What's what is it in uh, how they cheers in Italy? Uh, salute. Salute. Canoli. Noli. Anyway, enough for that. We had fun. We had super fun with him on Friday. We have a lovely friend now in England named Nadia. What did she send you? Oh, I mean, she's we're getting spoiled. I mean, she said, really is very nice. She sent a genuine in. English teacup made of bone china and, and, and 22 karat gold. Is on, is like, it's like plated on the mug. Yeah. We're not going to use that. Oh, no, 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 of course not. We, it's strictly we, ornamental. Strictly. Um, so that was, it's a crazy fun weekend. And then we got this lovely coffee yesterday, which, thank you, because I was literally out. Tony told me yesterday morning, hey, we're out of coffee. And I raced home last night, and guess what I forgot? What? Uh, coffee? Yeah, nothing gets past you, pal. Yes, coffee. I forgot coffee. And we opened the package, and guess what's in it? Coffee! Woo! All right, anyway. Um, hey, anything on your mind this morning? Anything we want to get out of the way and talk about? Um, well, uh... This coffee is nice. We, we got 10% off coupons for reorders. Yeah. I like it. Is it... I feel like there's a little bit of dramatics happening in the passenger seat. I feel like it's not that hot. It being dramatic. I'm over here slugging it away. Listen, we're not in a frat house. I'm not, not like challenging you to down it. I'm just saying I think you're being like... You're being a little extra this morning. It's the metal infrastructure where it acts as a conductor. A conductor for what? Whatever you... Well, conductors are metals that usually distribute a lot of heat throughout them. And insulators keep the heat in. Literally the smartest guy I know. Um... So I have my hair mask in this morning, which water's dripping down my neck right now as we speak, and it's so uncomfortable because it's 26 degrees outside. Mm -hmm. I'm cold. Do you want your seat warmer on? Yeah. You do? It's nippy. Okay, anything else? What else can we talk about this morning? Um, let's see. I just wanted to get some thank yous out of the way. We have over 4,000 viewing hours on our YouTube channel now. Huh. I mean, just about three weeks ago, we had 900 viewing hours. So I, I, 
thank you everybody for thank you, everybody. enjoying riding with us to work. I guess people like being in the car with us. Yeah. We could do a real road trip. We would like stop at Bucky's and get road snacks. I went a different way this morning and I'm, I'm questioning why. I don't know why I went this way. They don't usually go this way anymore. I don't like it. I don't like this road right here. It's too busy. I like a peaceful ride. This mockingbird just feels good, don't you know what I mean? It's like, oh, it's got a texture to it. It's like a powder coating. It's lush. Where are you with your dragon prince? Is the new season out? Nope. There is a season six coming, right? Oh, there it is, yeah. When's it due out? Who knows? What do you mean? They just don't tell you? They usually give the release date in the trailer, but they haven't released a trailer yet. It's so... Uh, when did the last season end? Uh, uh, last year about... Remember, but I can't tell you how. No, 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 no. I can't tell you how it ended. Well, yeah. Just in case you get people turned on to the show, you don't want to spoil it. Yeah, I don't want to spoil anything. But I just okay. Wait. So last year it ended. Yeah. Mm. What do you think it takes about a year? I don't know. Who's but, your hands down favorite character? Well, if I had to narrow it down to my top three. No, I want one. I want someone at the top of the podium. I don't want to hear your top three. Right. I want the number one. Everybody else, if, if all of them were falling off a cliff and you could save one, who are you saving? Rayla, because Callum could easily turn his arms into wings and catch Ezrin. Oh my gosh, you're such a genius. You figured out a way to save your top three. <laughs> Did you think ah, I love challenging you. Did, did you think my head was full of hot air? I did not, but I hear that you're English right now. Yes. Where did you get that phrase? Because I feel like you're saying it a lot. Is like, what? Where does it come from? Fess up. I I heard it in an episode of SpongeBob. It was the episode where he was going through his friend's dreams. His chick just beeped at me. What the? No, and now she's riding my tail, literally. Okay, we're gonna have a little bit of a moment here. I'm not gonna break test her, but I'm very tempted. This is a sample of me. I'm gonna have to. Uh, hang on, let me just give her a little good morning salute. Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. Sorry, I just wanted her to. Now, was that really necessary? I just wanted her to know a good morning hello from me for all of the beeping at me. I'm sorry I let you down. She needed to know. Back to the show. <laughs> Listen, did you see her? She was almost in the back seat with us beeping her horn at me. I was driving literally <laughs> the speed limit. There was nothing wrong. If she didn't manage her morning time well, that is not my fault. Right? Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. we don't manage our time well. Do we take it out on people? No. We just accept our fate and we're late. <sighs> not saying that's a good idea. No anyway, well, this was an interesting ride. I just had a an exchange. Oh, I still got a couple of sips left. You know, I'm, I, I, you know, I feel like these are bigger than our usual cups. What, uh, just, what just happened? Oh, it's us? scorching the back of my. I'm not used to it this hot. Okay, well, Buka, thanks for the hot coffee. Yes. Well, anyway, well, we survived thanks for watching, our... guys. Be sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and stay classy, planet Earth. Here we go. Just felt like that was so not heartfelt. That's that was not heartfelt. But... Heartfelt, smart, though. Well, I wait anyway. Okay. <laughs> that last three seconds of our car ride just got so weird. This lady came from another lane, zipped over and started beeping her horn at me and then was just literally on my tail and I was going to speed limit. And it was green light, like we were in the flow of traffic. 
what is wrong with people? It's Tuesday morning. I mean, unless there was a medical emergency in her vehicle, what are we doing? I mean, she looked like she was by herself. She was waving her fist in the window at, in the mirror. So I gave her the old one finger salute, whatever. Connor got mad at me, but want to act that way? Just may have something to say back. Maybe it wasn't the most mature move to make, but I did it. And I'm ashamed. So forgive me. I'll have to ask Connor. Just don't forget that happened. So anyway, happy Tuesday. Despite the weirdness on the roads here in our little town. Um, cool. Anyway, I hope everyone has a wonderful day. Um, thank you for riding with us. I mean, this stuff is real. I mean, clearly we're getting into minor scuffles of road rage. And it's going to be a beautiful day. We're going to get up to, I think, 60 degrees here in Georgia. Looks like we've got some beautiful sun coming out. So I'm excited. Um, pardon the dew. It's a, it's a hair mask. I'm just trying to... My hair is very color treated because I'm very gray, if truth be told. And I'm not going down like that yet. So just trying to condition the old hair. Anyway, have a super day. Thanks for tuning in. I'm glad that you've been enjoying, I guess, the few extra minutes of just me and Coco um, after we drop him off. And oh, for the record, before I completely sign off, I was downstairs and I said, I want to get to work on time. It was 6.36. I was gonna make the coffees and feed the dogs to help expedite him. So if you notice again this morning, he was very forgiving about the time because it was him. So I don't know what we're gonna do. Short of us getting up an hour earlier, I just don't know what we're gonna do. I just have to thank God that his bosses are so cool and forgive me. Okay, everybody. Happy Tuesday. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great Tuesday. Bye.